go and see the world and just show them What it really means to live life golden Yeah, we're golden, baby, yeah, we're golden They're about to see it shine, cause we're golden They can't ever break us down, cause we're golden Video, we are now Los Angeles County Sheriff Um So you're gonna get into today there's six and eight out of a species. All right, guys. So we just got a disturbance call here. Three oh eight with Spoochie. Vast these assholes. Ooh. Two zero six. I'm in route to the LAS number one call. So I'm presuming this is going to be the house right here. Leave the engine running. Going upstairs. Two zero six on scene. Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department, can you answer the door? Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. Great. I'm getting wet because of rain. I told you, like, four or five times, get out. Okay. This this is the law. All right. This is the Sheriff's Department. Do you mind if I come in? Sir, Sheriff's Department, open the door. This guy's gonna be real dickless. <laughs> Sheriff's Department, open the door now. Alright, oh, can can we talk, please? What? Uh, yeah, you, you, uh, uh, you can go. No, no sir. No, okay, listen. Alright, yeah. we're getting... Sir, I need you to open the door further than just a crack, please. Or invite me inside, that way I don't... You know, that way your house isn't getting soaking wet. Or we can go downstairs underneath the, underneath the covered area and talk. Okay, so you, we're coming to tell you to turn your music down, okay, because you're disturbing the entire block here, alright, and I would politely ask you to please turn it down, okay, because if we get out here, if we call back out here again, we're going to arrest you for, um, not arrest you, um, for disturbance, okay, I understand that this is your house, or this is your roommate's house, whoever it may be, alright, but I need you to at least be considerate of your neighbors, please, okay? Okay, let me... Okay, well, I'll go ahead and sit tight. Um, Alright, I need you politely to turn the music down, okay? I don't know why it's doing that. Okay, alright, well, sit tight, I'll be right back. Uh, 
great. This guy's gonna be one of those people. Okay, well. Let me get in the car, turn the headlights on, and let's, uh, let's look at the penal code and see what the disturbance, see what the disturbance is. Because I don't want to arrest this guy if I don't have to. A person who's unlawfully fights in public, no. Okay. So, section 051 is going to be the second one. Uh, we may need to go ahead and issue him a citation for the fine. It's going to be 400 hours, most likely. Alright, so let me go ahead and hop out here. Walk back up and see if he has ID. All right, sir. Yeah. Oh, there he is. All right. Uh, can you can you come downstairs with me uh, to my patrol car for me for a second? And do you have ID on you? Okay. I understand that, sir. But you can grab an umbrella or a coat real quick and come downstairs with me, okay? Or you can invite me inside real quick. Okay, sir. Well, uh, do you have ID on you? Uh, I'm, I'm giving you any ID. Okay. Do you realize failure to identify yourself is an arrestable offense, correct? Uh, arrestable offense? Oh, what, whatever. Okay. Alright, well, we're going to go downstairs and see what the neighbor has to say and if they want to press charges. Uh, no, we're gonna hold off on that. Let me see. Actually, let me look back in my penal code. And I'm going to see. I'm going to see. Failure to identify. Yep, it is. Right here, section 405. Failure to identify to a peace officer and a fine of a thousand. Alright. Yep. Uh, you decided to come down and talk with me? Uh, no, no, no. We ran out of booze. Okay, go ahead and stop right now, please. I, I don't want you walking any further, okay? Right now, from my scene, you know, from smelling, you have a large amount of alcohol in your system, most likely, okay? Uh, how much did you have to drink? Uh, quite a few. One, One two, three body, three bottles. Four bottles. I don't remember. Okay, and okay. You have ID on you? I'm, I'm gonna give it to you. 
Okay, at this current time, you're being detained. Okay, and failure to identify is up to 60 days in prison with a thousand dollar fine. Okay. Oh, well, let me go grab that then. I'm just letting you know it's going to be 60 days in prison and a thousand dollar fine versus a four hundred dollar fine. Okay, and right now you're you're deeply intoxicated, and I I don't want you to walk out because the moment you step on that sidewalk and from your house, it's public intoxication. Um. And you have house keys on you. Does your friend have house keys? Uh, probably. He's not there. Okay, where's your friend at? Uh, I don't know. Probably on the beach somewhere. Okay. In a restaurant. <laughs> Alright. Uh, what is your name? What is your last name, Caleb? Last name is Fuck You. Ah, that that's very nice. I'm Deputy Elijah Wilson with the Los Santos County Sheriff's Office. Um, I don't think uh, your last name is really Fuck You, sir. I, I don't think that's the last name there. That's, that's Mr. Mr. Fuck You. Okay. Sir, stop. What is your date of birth? You don't remember, okay? So, in order for you to be drinking, you have to be over 21, correct? Yeah, well, 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 how old do I fucking look there? Well, I'm just letting you know, sir, and I don't want you... Uh, sir, please stop. Please stop walking, please. I don't want you to slip well, and fall. I, go I, I don't fine. I don't want you to slip and fall and, you know, hurt yourself, okay? Oh, I'm sure it'd break your heart if I slipped and fell, hell. No, it it I want my I want your safety to be my number one priority, okay? So your name is Caleb Fuck You, right? And you don't remember no. your date of birth. No. Okay. So at this current time I have two options. Okay. Option one is you get a four hundred dollar fine for disturbing the peace, section five zero one. All right, that's a four hundred dollar fine, or you can get uh, option two, which is failure to identify to a peace officer, and that is sixty days in county jail, and that is a thousand dollar fine. And you need your ID in order to purchase the booze that you want to go get. I'm locked out. Okay, and do you keep a spare key or anything like that anywhere else? Uh, nope. Not my, not my house. I'm just okay. in there until Matt gets back. Okay, your friend name is Matt, right? Yeah. Do you have your phone on you? That way you can call Mr. Matt and let him know that he, that nope. you're locked out. You don't have a phone. Your phone's inside, correct? Okay, is there any way else that we can get into the apartment? By we, I mean you in the apartment. Um, Sir? Uh, you know, I think the sliding glass door is open. Okay, and the sliding glass door is... I'm presuming that you're... Yes, you're on the second floor. Up there. Yeah, I, I see that. Um. Yeah, so what I'll do is... I'll climb up. Get in through the this, this screen door. Oh, I don't know how you're going to get across from one side of the building to the other. Hey, pull, pull, your cruiser, pull your cruiser up right here and I'll climb on top of it. Of it. I, I'm, I'm not there pulling my cruiser up, sir. I, I'm not letting you stand. I'm not letting you stand. Get on the next balcony. 
I'm, I'm not let I'm not letting you stand on my cruiser, sir. All right, let me stand on your shoulders. No, don't get it. So there's no way you're gonna there's no way you're gonna make it from my shoulders to the second balcony or the first balcony. Well, we know we won't know unless we try. And we're not trying that, sir. Um. <sighs> I can call a pop and lock service. Pop and lock. Yeah, they come in, pop, pop the lock for you so you can get in. I can call them to see if they can come out. Alright, Matt won't be too happy about that. But... They won't do any damage to the door. They just, they're going to basically find a key that fits the hole. They're going to make a key there. And they're going to stick it in the keyhole and turn the lock and unlock the door. Uh, that's presuming what I think they do. Uh, yeah, whatever it is, you know. Alright. 206 here. Can I get a pop and lock to my location? 308 Goma Street off of the Vespucci Beach. Alright, I got pop and lock on the way. They said it'll be here in about two minutes. They're right around the corner. This guy is wasted a couple booze in and he's going to go buy more. Ooh. All right. Ah, uh, county lock, county pop and lock just came and unlocked it, so we should be able to get in. Go ahead and grab your phone and a wallet and some ID for me, please. All right. I don't like the way this is gonna go. Caleb, fuck you is his name. I highly doubt Caleb, fuck you is his name, but you know. We'll see. Okay. Sir. Sir, I need you to come out. I... Sir? No, oh, this this guy. Los Santos County Sheriff's Department. Come out here now. Uh, of course. Of course. Sir, come out now. Of course, this guy's a stubborn guy, and come out now. Unlock the door. Two zero six zero. I'm at seventy six and eleven three zero eight, Goma Street, Jelen Ave, Vespucci Beach. I have a guy that's. Uh, not complying. Sir, come out now. <sighs> Sir, the next time you don't unlock the door, the door's coming down and we're coming in. Unlock the door. I know your friend Matt does not want to sit here and do this. 
Uh, I, I'm so sorry. I, sir, please come out. Now, I don't want to do any damage to the door or to your house, your friend's house. I just... Okay. Okay. Last warning, I'm calling the pop and lock and they're coming to pop the lock. That way I don't do any damage to your door. Open it up now and we'll be fine. Okay. 206, give me a pop and lock 308, go my street again. stun gun because this guy is heavily intoxicated and if he charges me I'm gonna I don't want to do that sir the pop and lock is here they're getting ready to pop the lock if you don't unlock the door Sir, the pop and lock is here. They're currently unlocking your door. If you don't come and unlock it, they're going to bust the door down with the lock on it. Or I'm going to have them unlock the door and I'm coming in there. The choice is yours. Fuck pop and lock. Fuck you. you. Okay. You know what? I'm going to ask the neighbors. Do they want to press charges for... Alright, last warning, I'm coming in, kicking this door down with the pop and lock guy. The pop and lock guy is going to be standing in, out the way. And I don't want to kick your door down. Okay. Let me see. Hey, down here. Oh, hey, what's up? Yeah, I'm going to ask you to go unlock your door, or I'm coming up there and getting you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and I don't want to come and get you. Because right now, I can arrest you for failure to identify to a peace officer. And disorderly conduct. Yeah. And resisting, yeah. I must add. Come on, bro. Don't, don't, don't let me do this. I'm giving you two options. You can take a $400 fine, go down to the city, pay the $400, fight it in court, turn the music down, or you know you can go down for 60 days in the county jail with a $1,000 fine. I'm, I'm giving you a, a, a choice. Okay. What, what does that choice want to be? Okay. How about I give you my name? What is your name?
All right, Mr. Fuck You, what is your date of birth? Bunch of none your business. Bunch of none your business. On the 4th. Yep, yep. Okay. All right, well, you stay right there. And this guy is... <sighs> Looks like he's gonna go. Don't. Don't tell me he's gonna jump. I do not want him to jump. Because if he does, I gotta call County Medical. Mr. Uh... Mr. Fucky, are you here? Um, right where you left me. Right where you left me. Where? Yep. Alright, Mr. Fucky, come inside, please. Come on inside. Come on. Come inside, Mr. Fuck You. Come on. Come on. Come inside. Ugh. God. Turn around. Whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck is that thing? What the fuck is that thing? Turn around. Place your hands above your head. No, get that nope. Thing don't. Away from me. Stop. Stop. Bro. Bro, Bro, stop. Stop. Uh, he's just a drunk guy. Tackle, tackle, tackle. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Get on the ground. Stay down. Stand up for me. Walk over to my car. Uh, this current time, you have the right to remain no. silent. Anything you say can or be used against you in the court of law. You have a right for an attorney. If you cannot afford one, won't be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas. Do you understand these rights if I just read them to you today? No, sir, I, I need a yes or no answer, please. I don't need a, I don't know, sir. Uh, yes, yes, I understand. Okay. This current time, I'm gonna be searching you. Do I have, uh, do I have, do you have anything that's gonna put me, stick me, stab me? Guns, knives, grenades, anything like that? Man, you get people grenades? No, I don't have a grenade. And of course, I messed it up. All this guy had to do was turn his music down and took a $400 fine, and everything would have been fine. But he decided to resist. Failure to identify. Hmm. Go ahead and have a seat for me in the back, okay? Watch your head. Go ahead and sit tight for me, okay? Alright, so he is getting failure identified of a peace officer. 
Let me see if I can find. So I get disturbing the peace. And I don't think we have anything about disorderly conduct. If it is, it's probably going to be in our justice. No, so disturbing the peace. Disturbing the peace and failure identifying. Okay. All right, you stay here. I'll be right back. Two zero six show one uh, detained. Where is this music session at? I was leaning to find it here. Ah, that was some really loud music. So. He's currently going to go to down to jail for resisting and a failure to identify and disturbing the peace, which is a citation. So I'll get I'll catch back up with you guys when we are close to the station. Alright guys.